Coming off the football team's best season in 72 years, Coach Gary Patterson announced the highest ranked recruiting class in school history. The class is currently ranked 26th by recruiting site Rivals.com. You know, the thing that we like best about it, this is a great group of people. It's not only is it good athletes that, you know, we feel like met our needs, but it's a great group of people. One of the concerns for Patterson was replacing five senior wide receivers. So he signed five receivers, including two four-star athletes, Brandon Carter and Ladarius Brown. Brown was the highest rated member of TCU's class. The versatile receiver from Waxahachie is listed as the best all-purpose player in Texas. He was recruited as a receiver, but some analysts say he could easily play safety in college. Carter is from nearby Euless Trinity High School. He switched his commitment from Oklahoma to TCU just a few weeks before signing day. Brandon Carter was, he wanted to play an H receiver and, and uh, the other place he was going to there, he you know, talked about playing corner and he was close to home academically, felt like his mom felt like it was a better fit. Brown and Carter may get the chance to make an impact early in their career. Three of those guys will have to play this next year because of numbers. So it'll be interesting starting between now and then this summertime how they do it. The Frogs also addressed the defense, signing one of the highest rated defensive linemen in the country, Chucky Hunter. Despite high rankings, Coach Patterson said he doesn't care much about the Stars by their names. They haven't scored any touchdowns and they haven't made any tackles for TCU. They'll have to prove themselves here at the new Amon G. Carter Stadium. David Stein, TCU News Now.